We have a couple of winter driving days left uh, during this spring. Uh, slippery roads across Greater Grand Forks, side streets, and main thoroughfares. There's also out in the uh, highways around the area, especially in sheltered areas, you're going to find some uh, slippery spots. So slow down. It's not really spring yet. Uh, we've got some uh, winter driving weather yet. Uh, for a closer look at the weather, here's uh, UND's Atmospheric Sciences. Good morning and welcome to UND's weather update. My name is Dylan Boat. Winter weather advisory in effect for northern North Dakota and northwestern Minnesota until 6 p.m. tonight. Due to that falling snow and also drifting and blowing snow in spots. Roads are not the best out there as you head on Highway 2 to Devil's Lake and Minot. Partially covered roadways. I-29 looking similar, but as you head to Fargo, those roadways turn into scattered snow drifts pocket drifts throughout I-29. Minnesota roadways aren't looking much better. We have some partially covered roadways. Those are the blue colors and those pink and purple colors are completely covered or travel not advised. If you are heading out this morning, it is definitely something to be aware of. National satellite and radar shows us this big system up here, this low pressure system, going to continue to spin. It did spin throughout last night into this morning. Moving in, look at all that snowfall in Grand Forks and Fargo throughout the valley. North Dakota getting in, uh, most of North Dakota seeing some snowfall, and northwestern Minnesota, that will continue throughout the day today. Right now, outside in Grand Forks, we have some covered roadways, mostly snow. There is some icy spots out there, so do be careful. We're sitting at 26 degrees, wind of the northwest at 22 miles per hour, bring that wind chill to a very chilly 12 degrees. Temperatures right now throughout the region, low to mid-20s throughout North Dakota and much of northern Minnesota. Duluth is sitting at 30 degrees. Minneapolis at 34. However, more significant this morning with some snowfall is are those winds and that blowing snow potential. 22 miles per hour in Grand Forks, 22 miles an hour in Fargo, 16 miles per hour in Bismarck, 17 miles per hour in Minot. And in open areas, there can certainly be some blowing and drifting snow. For our forecast headlines, snow continuing throughout the day today and the possibility of some blowing snow, like I said, in open areas. And we're going to stay cool as we head throughout the week into the weekend. So for our future cast, this low pressure system is going to sit here in northeastern Minnesota and just spin and continue to bring some snowfall to the valley and much of North Dakota and northwestern Minnesota as we head into the evening hours. That snowfall is going to become more scattered and turn to more some flurries as we head throughout the overnight into tomorrow morning. And waking up tomorrow morning, we should just wake up to mostly cloudy skies and that's going to continue throughout the day tomorrow into tomorrow night. Moving on to future snowfall, how much snow are we expecting? Well, Grand Forks and Fargo, another inch or two is possible, but there is a swath along the Canadian border that could see two to four inches of more snowfall for this event. Today in Grand Forks, 31 degrees, one to two inches of snow with some patchy blowing snow. Winds on the northwest at 15 to 20, gusting up to 30 miles per hour. Today throughout the region, everybody in the low to mid 30s throughout northern Minnesota. There are some isolated 40s as you head south. Tonight, 24 degrees, that snow is going to push off to the east. Breezy out there with winds on the north at 10 to 15, gusting up to 20 miles per hour. Tomorrow, 32 degrees, cloudy skies throughout the day. So with some patchy blowing snow due to those northwest winds still being gusty out there, 10 to 15, gusting up to 25 miles per hour. Future weather for tomorrow, low to mid 30s for North Dakota, but northeastern Minnesota could see some low to mid 40s. As we go throughout southern um, South Dakota and southern Minnesota, there are a few spots that could hit a 50 degrees. For our seven-day forecast, starting out nice and cool and very wintry, but as we head throughout the week into our Thursday and Friday, the 40s should return before this weekend. We go to partly sunny skies and a shot at 50 for Sunday.